I'm Raj Achari, the commander of the NASA SpaceX Crew-3 mission to the International Space Station. I was born in Milwaukee, Wisconsin, but moved within a week to Cedar Falls, Iowa. My dad had come to the United States to get his master's degree where he met my mom. He got a job at John Deere, and that's why they moved to Iowa. One of the biggest things I took from my Iowa upbringing is sort of that inherent uh, community strength and the interest people had in, in everyone else succeeding and having a tight-knit community. I think I first became interested in flying at a pretty young age. My mom has pictures of me from back as a kindergartner being really interested in space flight. Uh, and I think as I got into junior high, the idea of going to the Air Force or flying became very appealing to me as well. And so astronautical engineering was a great way to be involved in the engineering for space. So at the Air Force Academy, there's all kinds of different engineering paths. You have the opportunity to continue on and do graduate school programs. It allowed me to go on and get a graduate degree at MIT, and it was a wonderful opportunity to, to take it to the next level. One path that is pilot training in my life, and another path is to continue this engineering. I found I really liked engineering a lot more than I thought I would. And then uh, a friend of mine had started talking about test pilot school, in which I realized, like, oh, that's actually a combination of both of these things. So for me, I think I first started thinking about the idea of being an astronaut was about the 2008 time frame. But it dawned on me that, oh man, this is not just some weird, like, I want to be an astronaut when I grow up. It's actually in the path that's realistically achievable. So what do you say? How about I introduce the 2017 astronaut candidates? Raja is a 39-year-old lieutenant colonel in the United States Air Force from Cedar Falls, Iowa. And so that was how I wound up on the path of applying. So on the SpaceX vehicle, my job as a commander is, is a fewfold. I don't need to tell Kayla, Tom, or Matthias how to do their jobs. They already know how to do their jobs. Uh, it's really more a matter for that 1% of the time where something off nominal happened. What is the best split of resources of, you know, what is the best interactions between those players to get the best result? And so managing those different uh, pieces of the puzzle is really, I think, what the crew part of the commander job is. It's really mind-boggling when you think about how much effort it takes to pe put people in space and then to sustain them in space. I think what's cool and why I like NASA is none of those people are doing it for the money. They're doing it because they believe in the mission. They're doing it because they believe in, in solving humanity's problems and pushing exploration. That's the reason people are doing it. I think, if anything, it's taught us that we as humans have this great ability to endure through just about anything. You just have to put your mind to it.